Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. We got Chef Brad Kent. He's also known as the Pizza Whisperer, and he's here with great information about Pi Day. Chef, how are you? I, I'm, I'm talking about pizza, so I'm wonderful. <laughs> I see that's close to your heart. Why do they call you the Pizza Whisperer? Um, because pizzas kind of talk to me. Um, and I think that's the best way of, of any type of cooking that you're doing is let the, let the food speak and you will, it will tell you when it's ready. It will tell you if it needs more salt, if it'll tell you if it needs a little bit more heat underneath it. Um, pizzas talk to me. That's why I call myself and people call me the pizza whisperer. All right, then. Okay, maybe, so Mark... Maybe I'm just crazy. Yes. No, everybody loves pizza, so that means we love you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, March the 14th is Pi Day. Should this become a national right. pizza holiday? It should be. Um, pot, is any reason to celebrate pizza is a, re, is a reason to celebrate. So, and, and, and I don't, Pi Day, it, it, my dad was born on Pi Day. He'll be 90 uh, on Pi Day. And, uh, and so, you know, one more reason to celebrate. Um, but. I think anything that celebrates anything round that you can eat is good, and, and I can't imagine anything more delicious and round to eat than a pizza. And then when you take away the slices, you can actually do an equation to figure out how much you have left. Um, and if you run out, you can go back to Blaze and get another pizza. Start okay. all over. I'm on a lot of platforms, and one of them is Instagram, and they want to know, how do you look so good and eat so much pizza? That's yeah, directed that's pretty simple. You. <laughs> oh, toward me, I don't, I don't know if I look so good. But um, it's, it's a lot of extra virgin olive oil. I think that's the secret to, to looking young and staying young. Um, we use a lot of extra virgin olive oil in our restaurants, and, and I think that's a key to making pizzas and anything, actually, that you're cooking at home tastes delicious. Um, and um, our extra virgin olive oil is a single a cultivar. We're using only um, extra virgin coming from the Piqual olives. Um, and we put that in our red sauce, in our pizza dough, and we use it as a finish. Um, and I think if you eat healthy, and like our restaurants, we don't have any preservatives, no, no chemicals, no flavors that are artificial, um, no colors that are artificial as well. I think eating clean like that is just a way of, of staying and, and, and maybe looking young too. Um, also, when you love what you're doing, kind of it shows. And anytime you could be in front of an oven and cooking pizza, it should make you happy unless that's not your thing. But it's certainly my thing. All right. What, what trends are we seeing in pizza? You know, everybody loves pizza. I'm, and what are some of the trends, right. though? Well, I think with the, this advent of, you know, the Internet, I, I'm sounding old, but, like, people like to see beautiful things. And I think that people want to see beautiful toppings on top of their pizzas. And I think that's one of the reasons that Blaze is so successful is we've got these beautiful, fresh, vibrant, colored toppings that photograph really well. Um, the nice thing that accompanies that is those things tend to actually taste good as well, and they're good for you, so there's no reason not to enjoy pizza over and over again. Um, as far as other types of things that are popular besides just the way that pizzas look and feel, I think people are also getting used to having uh, pizzas that have this artisanal uh, look and feel, uh, people, pizzas that are cooked with live fire um, from all, uh, is another thing that makes pizzas like have that like charred and irregular surface on the crust that you see on a blaze pizza. So I think all of those things are kind of, those are important and not things that should be overlooked when you're talking about pizzas. And then if obviously, you know, you could talk about toppings, um, vegan toppings are popular, um, lower calorie toppings are popular, but also the traditional stuff right now is really popular. People want to feel comforted. So eating something that's like one of the most comforting, comforting of foods, a pizza can make you feel good about yourself and, and feel, and, and knowing that it's something that's all natural should make you feel good eating it as well. Okay. And finally, as I wrap up, one of my favorite things, how can uh, someone well, qualify for 11-inch um, uh, uh, pizza? 
Okay, so 11-inch pizza for $3.14 is really easy to do. All you need is a, a phone uh, that can get it to an app store, and it seems like a lot of people have those, and then all you gotta do is you download the app for Blaze Pizza, and then um, you sign up for the rewards, and once you sign up for the rewards, and you're, uh, uh, then you will get pushed a $3.14 discount code that you can redeem at Blaze Pizza on 314, which is Monday, or any day for the rest of the month. But you gotta make sure to sign up before or on 314 in order to make that work. Bring your All family right too, then. they'll get the same price, yeah. All right, we'll spread the word. Thank you. All right, Chef Ken, thank you so much, and I'm glad you love pizza, because they love it at my house also. Have a great day. You too, thank you so much. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I host the Valder Beebe Show, broadcast on radio and television. And this is My Phone Pouch. My Phone Pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.